In this video I'm going to show you how you can use our central monitoring software to access an IP camera SD card storage. Now this assumes that you've already connected your IP camera to the central monitoring software and that you have the SD card installed and a recording schedule enabled for your SD card. So in order to access the storage on our IP camera's SD card we're going to first go to the central monitoring software. We're going to go under the second section called search and we're going to click the playback button. And here we can see we have the devices that are connected to our central monitoring software. And we're going to go ahead and select our 4K camera. This is the camera that has the SD card installed. And we have some footage available on our SD card. So we're going to click the search button. It's going to bring up the recorded video on our SD card. In order to, to zoom in on this, we can use our scroll wheel on our mouse while hovering over the timeline. So I'm just hovering over my timeline and using the mouse wheel on my mouse to scroll in. Here we can see we have a continuous recording and motion detection recording. The continuous recording is green, the motion detection recording is yellow. If I had a smart detection camera and enabled my smart detection rules, the smart detection video would show up in an orange color on my timeline. So here, in order to access the playback on my timeline, I'm just going to click in the spot where I want to access the timeline. Here I just want to see the continuous recording at the beginning of my SD card. So I pulled it up. It's in the first camera grid view. If I wanted to make this larger, I would just double click on this quadrant of the grid. It's going to bring it into full screen. And here you can see it's fluidly playing back what was recorded on our SD card. Now we can see what triggered our motion event up here, and notice we did not have motion configured and it was just continuously recording at this point. Here's where we configured our motion detection. And we can see that this car coming in the right hand side of the frame here was what triggered our motion detection after we enabled it. Hopefully this video helps you access the SD card recording on your IP camera. Thank you for watching.